Hello the tube, how is it going? I hope everything's going good and uh, it's a big buddy back morning and I hope everything goes well for you today. Anyway, right, then go through a bit of a scenario. Right, I've been trying to picture, been trying to sort out my bag up bag now for a while now and I don't know what to take, what shouldn't I take this, that and the other and all the other sweet bollocks and what have you. So basically my mind is frazzled, right? So obviously gonna take Ridge Monkey. Hundred percent gonna take that because I know what it does, I know it cooks well, I know it's perfect, I know it's non-stick and it's light as a bastard and I'm gonna take it. Simple as so this thing is just ridiculous it's yeah it's a wall prop really you can't really whack nothing because the tongue will probably smash up and fair enough if you could weld it so the tongue would be perfect you know what i mean it'd be be a nice blade you know what i mean but you can't go whacking on something and I'm the tango, so that'd be a big no-no. So basically what I'm looking for today off you guys is to give me like a yay or nay in what to put in my bug out bag sort of thing. Which is gonna be kinda of hard because you guys are gonna to have to text and I know a boring texting can be and this, that and the other, so we're just gonna to have to fly with it, right? This is obviously a yes, because that's, that's my container, that, that's obviously a yes. My fire kit, you all see my fire kit, got fat wood, got lighter, I got some of the lady face wipey things. They all love to use. I got my ranger bands or cut up all different sizes just to throw in the flames, get a boom, get the plumage of you know, black smoke, this, that, and the other. So, hey, call, you know, it's gonna cause alarm, it's gonna call people. Right, I got this big little striker. I'm not 100% on it. I've never used it tidy, so I am got nothing bad to say about it yet. But I will be trying it soon. So that's that, that's that, that's that. I've got... Shotgun cartridge. Basically full of tampons and full of uh, petroleum jelly. I haven't seen it yet, just to show you guys. Uh, it's just full of petroleum jelly and full of tampons and I'll end up sealing it with wax and I'll put it in my fire kit and hopefully, yeah, the girls will dig it. No, um, should be alright, I'll be days, you know what I mean, that'll fly in the fire kit, that'll be lovely, so I'm going to put that over here. Uh... I will definitely be taking this knife because that'll be going on my neck. That goes everywhere with everywhere with me and it's as sharp as a bastard, fair play to it. Love this knife. Cracker. I'll be taking Leatherman charge as well. You know, it's got all the tools, it's got all the bits, bobs. I'm gonna need a lot of crap, so that's coming with me as well. Uh, it's down the, down the side of the shed, uh, down, down the side of the bed now. I've got the Mora Pro C, which is just, it's got a mini fishing kit in there, it's got loads of cordage, it's got the fire stick, and it's got ranger bands, a ranger band. It's all ready, you know, same as the, the Haltafa mini fishing kit, this, that and the other, so I don't know where do I take them. I don't know, but 
you know, they got they got everything there. So the bear grills knife, I've I've used it, but not as much. Like I said, but I got the uh, I've lost something nightmare. Um, yeah, I've got the uh, it's called a range of bands all set up just in case you never know you you know what i mean oh they always come in handy but do i take that this knife is a definite yes it's my favorite one so far it's the ganzo i love this knife i think it's the best so far so probably prob probably the best fixed blade i've got so far and it stinks of smoke because it smells so good. Uh, in the back, like I said, Ranger Bands, and I've got Ferrocene Rod on the side with Magnesium Strip. But every single one of them is all covered with paracord. Inside, they got... They're all wrapped paracord. Par you know, so you can't really see paracord, 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 and then I got like a paracord bracelet that I don't wear no more, so I just put that up there anyway. Fits perfect. So, out of all these, which would you take? I I'd definitely be taking this, so that's definitely be taking that. That's 100%. I'd probably end up taking that as well. Don't ask me why, but uh, yeah, it's not too bad. I've used it, I've chopped with it, I've, you know, it's done a few good things for me, but it's just the BG on it. I'm not a big fan of it, but it's a good bear, it's all right, it does job. The Mora's cracking knife, leather knife, sharp as a bastard, fair play to it. I've greased it all up, and fair play to her, she is a beast. Help the fat, love the help the fat, and like I said, it's got mini fishing kit in there, and there's plenty of powder cord. It's got the fire starter, it's got more powder cord there. Uh, right. You've all seen my cook set from the last video that I done out when I when I messed up my bacon. Well, I forgot my bacon and sausage so that'll definitely be going in the bug out bag 100 percent that'll be going in 150 percent i know there is no 150 percent but that'll be going in 125 percent then pellets for the fruit for the for the for the for the wood, wood gas stove, definitely you know that's definitely gonna come, isn't it? Obviously, I've got teas, coffees. Uh, accelerator, spoons, this that and the other. They all gotta go, like I said. Bandana. I mean, what, I, what I'm trying to do now is trying to get together what I think would be wise to put together into the bug out bag itself. You know, so I could just leave it to one side and happy days and, you know, the Ushabunga will be there just in case something happens and I can just shoot off and just grab the bag and go two seconds two seconds two seconds This thing will be 100% coming with me as well because there's so many uses for this thing. Uh, cheers Kurt for that, thank you very much. 
this thing will 100% be coming with me and well happy for finding it, thank you very much um, got some waste bags, got some rubbish bags You've all seen the you've all seen the ridge monkey, that'll definitely hundred percent be coming with me. Uh another health defer. I can't see that coming with me, but fair play is a nice little knife. I do like it. You know, it could come in handy, especially for around the house. Favourite blade to take would be probably I love this charade, uh, I had the soft gem, and big thanks for that gem. This one will probably be coming in my pocket as like an EDC blade. Either that one. That one. Other guns or so one of one of well, the same one of the three. Thing is, you don't want to go take in everything too. You know, I don't want to make everything too major heavy sort of thing. You know what I mean? So I want to chill out on some stuff. So I'd probably I like this one so much. I'd probably end up stashing it in a nice place where it would not rest up so I can always come back for it but I think it's sharp I think it can get really sharp and quite possibly it's going to come and this one I like just a bit of a fear factor really isn't it? come on you know what I mean sort of thing but yeah so we'll see about that Would you take the knuckle duster? Oh, lost the screw. Would you take the knuckle duster slingshot? That's all thing. It's probably worth taking. At the end of the day, so yeah. So I'm gonna put that to the side. So that's probably be a yes. Uh. I got another little Molly bag. Yeah, ready for this bag. Right, let's move on to these. I could probably tie them around my waist and just case something happens, sling them at people, sling them, do, do whatever I gotta do, you know what I mean? Keep myself alive, keep my family alive, or this, that, and the other. I'm just going through a scenario a bit now, guys. I'm not going mental, you know what I mean? I'm not being, oh, he's going mental, he's going, he's going to go mental, he's going to, he's going to end up shooting, not shooting, like, but stabbing the world and this, that, and the other. And like I said, I'm just trying to get a bug out bag sorted so I can just grab it, bug out, basically. So, what else I got? Uh... My goal is my goal is to get a DD top and everything. So I've had a few packs of heavy duty pegs to go in the packs, uh, to go in the in the tops and in the tents. You know, just in case you need to sort out. You know, you could be on like like rough terrain or whatever, and you can always slap it in. Uh, two seconds, guys. I'm gonna lift the camera up. Right, I hope that's a little bit better. Um, I 
like a file that I was thinking about taking. I know it's heavy, but you know what I mean? You can sharpen knives with it. I know like some of the knives, uh, some of the knives already got sharpeners on them, but I was thinking, you know, could I even cut them down and just take like a little portion of one or two of the actual file, not taking the old file set. So, um, well, it's, I take a power bank. This one is pretty crap. I got another one coming. Um, this the one I got coming is supposed to be a lot better than this one. So happy days. So I'll definitely be taking that. Like I said, guys, this is just like a rundown of what you think that could go into my bag out bag or should go into my bag out bag. Because I don't want to carry stuff around in my bag out bag, which. I'm not going to need bag or bag in. I've got a cover for the actual rucksack itself. I've got... It's like a neck blanket and uh, a foil, let's call it like a space blanket, so you know what I mean, it's all going to come in handy and shit. So I'll try and make this as quick as I can now because my sister's just rocked up and she's going to want me to go somewhere with her I know she's like and she's going to cook my brain. So anyway, guys, this is the bag. It's a mean bag, fair play to it. Uh, I got all, all the normal stuff in here. I got the hand sanitizers. I got all the what they call them bandages and all the wrap around things. I've got. Imodium tablets, this, that, and the other. I got water, water perforication tablets. I got iodine. I've got, you name it, I've got it in there so far, which I think is pretty good, but I can always add to more. That's the survival handbook. That was for a good read. <laughs> I've seen these in China, guys, and I just thought, hey, hey, why not? This could be fun. So, but, uh, they're not knuckle dusters, but they're uh, gloves with hard knuckles on them. Uh, just in cases, you never know, shit could hit the fan, might need on Monday. Uh, there are loads of pockets in these Molly bags. I bought these Molly bags separate and they're all set up tidy. Uh, there's bug repellent. Yeah, there's bug repellent, there's... Oh, there's tons of Molly atta attachments to this bag. I bought these two. It didn't come with it, but there's plenty. You can't really see, but there's a big pocket in here. Inside, there's another another pocket there. What's the bag called? So it's probably a cheapy bag. I really don't know. Uh, in this one then. Like I said, I know you get what you pay for, guys, and uh, I had this given to me, so I just dolled it up a bit, put some paracord on it. You know, you can you make it into a pick or a shovel or whatever. It's got a compass.
you can make, you know, you can fill it up like raw survival stuff. But yeah, I suppose that's gonna come. Got paracord, obviously, I wouldn't take it in this. I'd make it in one of the loops that'll you know wrap around and just pull out, and then the loops would come out easy enough, you know, straight away, nice and fast. So it'd be easier than taking this. I've got a rucksack liner. To, Try and keep everything in the rucksack nice and cool, uh, nice and cool, sorry, nice and dry. And I just hope it works. Basically. Jill, I'll be there now and chat in, right? Jill, I'll be there now and chat in, right? I got carabiners. Yeah, they they pretty pants ones, I know that, but like I said, they got, uh, it's just for carabiners really, isn't it? And you got the, the bracelets, it's just adding more paracord really, isn't it? These ones were not too bad, they're better than, these ones are like a plastic one, so I doubt I'd use these, but they'd be right like for hanging stuff on the bag, but these ones are okay. I got I got a few of these just normal zip tie food bags. Hey hey, you gotta have a game of past the pigs, guys. Past the pigs is the thing to have. It's a game it could be perfect in a bug out situation. You got two you got two pigs and they gonna land on. You gotta throw the pigs, and once they land on a certain, you know, if they touch each other, you know, it could be make and bake, and they get so many points. It's just to pass the time away in a bag out situation. So I think every bag out bag should have a game, like a game of cards. People like cards, whatever. I love pass the pigs. Pass the pigs is the game for me. And I think everyone should learn how to play past the pigs. Basically, there's your pigs, you roll your pigs, uh, they made of plastic, they can land on each other, they could be like bonking, and that's called like making bacon, you get 15 points, and you write it all down. And yeah, definitely come in with me, 100%. If I could put this back in. But yeah, like I said, I'm not looking for everyone to comment and say, yeah, 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 you need this, you need that, you need this, you need that, you don't need this, you don't need that. It's just a general whereabout of if you think I'm going right, if you think I'm going wrong. I don't obviously I don't want to go in like in the wrong direction. I want to get a bag of bag that'll that'll be handy for any any kind of situation. I got. Glow sticks, shake them up, snap them, stick, you know, stick them on the end of a power cord, spin them round and start a big party going off. But yeah, there's loads of rooms, loads of room in this bag. There's pockets there, there's pockets in the back. Uh, I got myself a little sewing kit. I, c I can't sew, I haven't sewn for years, like, but I can't sew. Um, sun sunglasses, got my sunglasses, because I've been like, a bit of a fisherman sort of guy, like. Uh, it's just Polaroid sunglasses, they not the expensive one, but they're okay, they'll do a job. <laughs> These were like a novelty pack, I thought, yeah, I got all of them, two seconds, I'll put them on through now. Bum, bum, bum. They call you bags, and basically, oh, la, 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 la. they call you bags, and basically you put them on, 
and I said I don't think to be able to see I'm not sure but <laughs> it's novelty you know what I mean but they do work they do work tidy fair play I think I fell off to be honest I think I put it on the wrong one so I'll try it again clipped on All I do I'm just wasting time now and I Sorry about all the rambling guys. As I'm not sure if you've uh... <laughs> it's different, you know what I mean? But anyway, for like um they call you bags. And I wouldn't go anywhere without my Bamaha. You know, squishy buffalo art, pack it away, boiling art day. Pack it away, just squish it up and guarantee to be back to normal whenever you need a perfect art. I love it. Buddy bar kiss for me. Definitely. Ah right, twice well, so I got I got some carabiners. I got yeah more carabiners. This is the lighter. Basically you put the fuel in which it's here, boy. Fill up the fuel and it's like a flint and strike gun. Flint and strike. So you'll get fire. So that bag's empty. So yeah, you've got plenty of pockets. Plenty of pockets. But what to fill them up with, obviously, I need, I need a torch, I need this, I need that. Going to the main bag now. Of course, got my Ridge Monkey light. I'll always take out with me. That's going everywhere with me. Water straw. Got to have a water straw. Uh, I got a set of three dry sacks for oxy like you know the rack sacks because if you if you google i think it's um a privy a privy roll or a bivy roll or something it's called it shows out the pack it clothes all tidy and nice and neat and it all fit in your bag it'll be perfect if i can i'll drop a link to Whatever it's called, I really can't remember it's called now. A uh, privy, privy bag or something. Anyway, it's my cook set. Yeah, it's only a cheapy one, but you know what I mean. It does, it does what it does, guys. Uh, I put it, I put it down a bit. I know I'm trying to rush out, but I just, I think that it's my accent and everything. Perhaps you don't get my accent, and I don't I just don't want to make it too boring, you know what I mean? So you got your pots, you got your pans, you got your frying pan, you got your lid. And I think, I think that's your butt crack cleaner. No, it's only joking, it's to clean the pots, I know that. Uh, yeah, and good thing about it, they all come in these like little net bags, which is kind of cool. Uh, will it go back in? Will it go back in? Yeah, ch chaps, if you can, please give me a little comment on, you know what I mean, what I, what I need or what I don't need or what I need to add. Uh, it's just like a hygiene kit. Basically, you got tissues, you got moisturizers, you got Vaseline, you got uh, hand sanitizer, you got dental floss, toothpaste. 
little cut down toothbrush, uh, toilet wipes, I think I've said that, body wash, this, that and the other. So that'd be another thing to go in. I said it's only a quick, quick little rundown, view down of what stuff I've got and obviously I will be tweaking it. It's just, I know I'm trying to rush now because i got my sister here as well and I'm supposed to be going out with her and she will only be bitching. You know, she's like, no women like, no offence ladies. Uh, got for another first aid kit then. It's got uh, super glue in, bandages, gloves. This tape is brilliant. I'm not sure what tape it is, but it's... It's like a gauze tape, you know, you wrap it around and it'll stick to, you know, that's stuck now. And you put enough on it, you do a break, that'll sort the of break out, that'll be perfect, that will. But, I said, I'll definitely go into more detail when my sister F's off. So I think, think, think. I said I got the alcohol stove with the ethanol. I don't think I'll take that. I think I'll go with the route of taking the the wood burning stove. I do like the ethanol, as it don't wreck the bottom of the pans. Like I've used this once and it's wrecked the bottom of the pan, whereas the the ethanol it was tidy, it came out like brand new sort of thing. So um, I got tonnage and tonnage, I could like ranger bands and things, so I can cut them down, make them into strips for fire lighting and whatnot. a bit more fat wood uh, obviously got for tape I need got a signal mirror I got some of these, I got some cut down so they fit into, I'll put a picture at the end of this hopefully, so it'll all fit down into um, like a survival tin case, whatever. I'm wondering, do I take some strop, do I take some strop, um, whatever it's called, you know, to sh uh, sharpen the compound. Sorry, compound. Do I take extra compound? As the shit's going to be hitting the fan, I've, I was making it. This I made that about three, four years ago, but still. Um, No, I can't find my, my ethanol stove at the moment. This bag is just... I'll go I'll go through this with you again. Because it's got a bit of everything and then it'll probably take a good while to go through. It's got another case. It's got it's plenty of, you know, I mean, there's loads and loads and loads and loads of bags. Um, pockets in the back of this. I got a, a mean poncho. It's nice, thick. It's uh, it's not one of the cheap ones. It's a tidy one. I got a two liter bladder, water bladder as well for uh, cycling, which 
I, I could put it in the back of that. You know what I mean? Take it out of this bag and I have stuff in there. Sort of thing. And... And... And I'll be taking my strong arm. 100% I'll be taking that. So guys, uh... If you can, in the comments below. I know it's been a bit of a mismatch of uh, shit, really. You know what I mean? But I don't know what to make out of. I don't know what to put into a bag or bag to make it a tidy bag or bag. I know there's millions on the tube and things, but any comments would be perfect. If you want to share, subscribe, or just chat away, just. 100% it means so much to me but I hope to make my bag up bag bag up bag buddy back special <laughs> kind of soon but I am working on it and thank you very much and take care of and chat to you soon take care tube